So you've obviously seen a few tricks now. Yes. Uh, yes. But I think it's time that you learn to become <laughs> a card magician. Not just a card magician, but a card hero. Okay. Have you ever done card tricks before? No. So you're starting off as card zero. We're yes. going to turn yeah. you into card hero. Okay. All right. Yeah. <laughs> and luckily, there's just three simple steps you need okay. to follow, right? So the first step is, um, obviously, I've got a deck of cards, and you can see they're all regular, and I've got all... Yeah. Ace of clubs or whatever. Uh, the first step to card hero okay. is you need to be able to cut the cards. Mm -hmm. And that's all you need to do. So what happens is you grab some cards yep. and then you put the others on top. Oh, okay. Like that. Yep. And that's it. So uh, show me that. Okay. So you just cut the pack okay. anywhere. Watch me mess this up. No, that's great. <laughs> Perfect. So you're Yay. that's stage one of card <laughs> hero. So if you were a professional, yep. the next step is to do that, but with the cards held behind your back. <laughs> So you put the cards behind your back. Now. Yeah, go for it. And then lift off some cards and then put them on the bottom. That's it. <laughs> you nearly, some people do this. Some people bend the knees as they cut. It looks very elegant and very, oh, no. there we go. There we go, I think it's done. That's done. It doesn't feel right. But... No, that's all right. Now keep the cards behind your back. I don't want to see a thing. And then um, to be a card hero, <laughs> you have to just keep doing that. You have to cut, but not always in the middle. Sometimes it takes lots of cards. And then, and then cut them, and sometimes take just a few and cut them. Now? Yeah, go for it. Excellent, and again, you'll see sometimes the knees. Mm, That's like, how you know like that quick. it's happening. <laughs> That's all right, you only have to do it once or twice, but you are now, you've gone from card zero to card hero in like 20 seconds. That's pretty good, isn't it? Yeah. Whenever you're happy, whenever you're happy that the cards behind you are mixed up, yeah. I want you to take the top three cards and put them into a pocket. Yeah. Yeah, just tuck them into your pocket. I'll take the rest of the cards back and we're going to pop them into the box. Perfect. I'm not going to look at a thing. They're just going to go okay. straight in there. So that is all your hard graft done and dusted. Right? Now yeah. I'm going to do the same thing because I'm a bit of a card hero myself. Okay. Uh, but obviously I can't use these cards because these are three cards short. Yeah. So I'm going to use the other pack which I've got here. And again, I'm going to show you that they're not... It's important that you see that they're not all uh, Ace of Clubs or anything like that, that all the cards are different and they're mixed yeah. up. Right? Okay, so I'm going to do exactly the same thing as you. I'm going to put the cards behind my back. Like I'm going to give them a couple of cuts. There we go. <laughs> and then mix them again. Very elegant. Yeah, I do my best. <laughs> with, what, with what I was given, I do my best. Um, and I've got three cards as well. Uh, so would you mind taking out your three cards and just hold them in your hand as if you're about to deal like this. So take the first card like this. And the first question I have to ask you, Kaylee, is do you believe in coincidence? No. Yes. <laughs> no? You don't believe in coincidence? That's a coincidence, nor do I. Turn the cards over. That's uh. weird. Do you believe, take the next card, do you believe in intuition? Yes. I had a feeling you'd say that. Uh. Turn over the next one. The two of clubs. No, right. And finally, do you believe in mind reading? Don't answer, because I already know. <laughs> Show the camera the last card. Professional card zero to card. Thank you very much.